Hello everybody, my name is Ghosty, and welcome back to Ele- To- Uh, sorry. Hello everybody, my name is Ghosty, and welcome back to episode 11 of Minecraft Fantasy. As you can see, I'm here with Wendy, we were just going on a bit of a fly, we, you know, we flew around quite a bit. Cause you know, these, these wings, they are growing, you can see the muscle definition in them, like, you cannot slack on developing those muscles. Cause you know, she's, she's growing up, look at her, look at her, beautiful girl. Okay. And I seem to be experiencing a bit of a there's two of me glitch. <laughs> but, you know, I still feel like one person. It's fine. But yeah, we'll just we'll just go home. Ah. All right, come on, Wendy. We'll go. Wait, I already I put Wendy back. Why can I still hear Hello? What? Wait, hold. What even? Hold. Let's see. What? What even in the what? Hello, pixies? And a hippogriff. It was flying into the wall. Oh, one died. Hello. What are you? What are you doing here? Hello? Hello. Hello? They all see wait, hold on. They all seem to be like hurt in some way. How are you? Oh, you're also. Oh. Did, did they know that I have Are are all of you here for the for the spring for the hot spring? Is that what you all need? Okay, well, I guess I'll bring them. I don't know who you're attacking. Are you attacking me? I don't think so. Are you stuck? What are you? Hey, 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 hey. What? Okay, I guess we're separating the pixies first. Um, pixie, you can stay in with the chickens. <clears throat> I didn't know that they hated each other. Okay. Did you calm down? Was it just that one pixie? Okay. All right, I guess. Okay, well, how do you feel about Lord Scrockington? Do you anything wrong? Do you, do you tolerate each other? Huh? Lord, where are you going? Lord, 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 where are you going? Okay, I'm gonna humor this. Where are you trying to go? Hello. Are you really going after the pixies? Oh, okay. Yeah, sit down. Okay. So, for now, we're gonna put the pixies in with the chickens so that they'll be safer. I mean, the chickens shouldn't be able to eat them. They seem... Yeah, they, they should be fine. As long as they stay up high. Hello. I'll come back and get them. You, know, you guys will be safe in here, it's okay. Lord, let's 
come back into the let's come back into the back please come on what are you can you please stop attacking jeez okay lord squawking didn't isn't even teleporting okay what are you attacking? Is there a pixie on the other side? No, there's a lord on the other side. Okay, I guess I'll just... I'll just make sure all the pixies are in a room. Before I sort this out. Okay. Because we do not need but that are you attacking can i get you okay are you gonna stop are you gonna be nice play nice okay so i guess I'll just put lord squawkington i guess just down here for now you can hang out all right And then we'll go get the hippogriff and make sure that you get all healed up. Come on. Why? Who are you even attacking? There's nobody here. Okay, well. Really? Alright, quit that. Quit that. This is... Can you quit scratching up my wall, please? He just doesn't want to, no. These pixies have done nothing to you. Oh, pixie, I would not recommend that. Are you... Are you chill now? Okay, well... Well, let's get you healed up. There you go. Do you feel better? You're less annoyed at the world? Oh, look at you! That's good. Okay, well... How... Can I... <laughs> okay. Fine. You're gonna make me chase you around, I guess. I mean, it's it's really good that you have your energy back, but I don't really fancy chasing you all over my basement. Oh yes, please. Yes, we're all gonna be friends here now. Oh, hello, Beefcake. How are you? Are you settling in? You settling good? That's excellent. Such a handsome young man you've become. Such a handsome man. And we'll say hello to Woolens while we're over here. Hello, Woolens. Hello. You having a good time? That's excellent. Okay. So since you're feeling, you're clearly feeling better, would you like to go back home? Alright. I don't really know where your home is, but... Mm, okay. You can stay. You can stay until it's day. Alright? Alright. Meantime, we'll go take care of those pixies. Alright, one by one, girls, come on. Alright, you're fine. You're good. You seem to be good. You seem... You're just... Okay, it's just you two left then. What even the heck? I did not expect it this spring to spring off like this. Like... We've got five whole pixies and a hippogriff just in my restaurant. And I, was, I wasn't even gone for that long. 
I just... Jeez. Alright, come on. We'll go back. We'll go back and we'll get you all... Get you all home, homely. These seem to be... The pixies from... Campograph. Are you stuck? I guess we could just take this down for now. Since I don't really need it. You know, it's just trying out some of my spaces. Oh, we can, we can eat. We'll just have food. Are you still stuck? Are you just choosing to be there? Do you like the pot? Alright. Yeah, it seems like... Okay, it's about halfway through. So I guess we'll just wait. I guess we'll we'll fix you guys up some food while we wait. What do you what do you think? Mm, you look like a pumpkin pie man. You look like a man of pumpkin pie. How does that sound? Yeah. And the pixies, they're obviously kid girls. Here you are, have some pie for the road. Let's see, what kind of cake should we do with pixies? Mmm, cherry cheesecake? I'm feeling cherry cheesecake. And I guess we're gonna bury this chicken. Or we'll feed some of the fishes. Here you go, fishies. Have some chicken. Batter. Tofu. Bakeware. Then we'll add a cherry frosting. Beautiful. Girls, while you wait until morning comes, you can have. Let's see. Should I do this? I'll put it on a pedestal for you guys. Okay. Maybe a slightly lower pedestal. There you go. Have some cake. Have some cake. I hope you enjoy. Oh, and it looks like it's yeah, just morning. All right. Now, what are you attacking this time? Okay, I guess I'll go. I'll take the pixies back to their village one by one. There you go. I don't know which house is yours, but you know. Try not to get hurt again. Jeez. And, and can you tell the rest of your fairy, your pixie friends to not come into the restaurant? Because, you know, there might be customers in there someday and then they might try to hurt you. Or, you know, something like that. And I guess I'll give you back your pixie dust. So you can... I'm not sure what p pixie customs might be to do with fallen friends, but... You know, I hope you... Yeah. Are you done attacking yet? Yes, you are. Now... I trust that you can find your way home, alright? Yep, get your bearings. Actually, that gives me an idea. Or like more more of a solution. Hello, more of a solution than an idea. They practically overtook the restaurant. Hello. And you know, just leave whenever you're ready. But they practically overtook the restaurant. And that's not really a good thing. Because well, you know the type of people. But when I was carving out the chicken there's a zombie there. But when I was carving out the, the place for the chickens. When I was carving out a place for the... What are you doing here, Lord? Alright, well. I found this cave. Which goes down... See, there's the chickens right there. But it goes down pretty deep. And I think I could connect this. What do you even- I don't- I don't know, Lord. But I think I could connect this to something in the- like, to the basement. I think I could- I could connect this to the basement. Maybe, maybe, maybe. Oh, okay. 
yeah, see, here's the basement right here. Lord, are you gonna come down or not? There he is. But see, this is the basement right here. So, if we just connect this all up, then the animals could come directly to, to the basement instead of me having to get them all through the door and into the spring. And then that could just... Um, yes, patrol. Patrol down here. This is your house. You know, I haven't seen Sir Cockles. Let's go, let's go make sure he's alright. I think I saw him, yeah, somewhere in this tunnel. I think was where he was. Yeah, here he is. Sir Goggles, did you, did you get yourself stuck? <laughs> Silly. What are you doing back here? You can suit yourself, I suppose. And I guess while we're down here, we can put Wendy back in her cave since I'm sure she doesn't like being cooped up in the t in the horn. Oh. Fantastic, Sir Cockles. Absolutely fantastic. Fantastic work. Fantastic job. I'm so proud of you. And I'm proud of you, Wendy. Oh, look at them. They're friends. Yes, Wendy, she is getting up there. And, like, she's going to be, like, as tall as up there. I think I've already said that before, but she's going to be the size of this cave. So, I mean, eventually we will need to expand it. You know, hello, Wendy. Hello, you are so beautiful. You are so beautiful. Just absolutely gorgeous. Hmm. I'm so lucky. But yes, what I was doing. Oh, see, so sleepy time for Wendy. We'll take a little sleep. We'll have a little. Oh, I, I see where it's not lit up. So, Cockles, are you gonna sleep with us too? Alright, good night. And good morning, Wendy. Good morning, so Cockles. And then up here. So, we're, we're just gonna basically make this a bit more accessible to be able to go up and down. Cause you know, like like we saw the hippogriff, you need all sorts, all sorts of mobs are being attracted. All sorts, all sorts of creatures. All sorts of creatures are being attracted. This idea came to me because I didn't even know this was here. Look at how hidden this is. Like, nobody's gonna stumble on this just accidentally. And I could even add more leaf cover. But the, but the animals, they would they're able to find it since they were they were so attracted to the um to the magical spring and like some of those pixies they were from far away and i don't even know where that hippogriff came from so they clearly must have a great sense of direction oh the sucky oh sucky's got a new little building but it's for the hippocampus We'll go, we'll go see the next episode because episode, this episode is already long enough. I've already got too many things to do this episode. We'll, we'll go next episode. We'll see how they're settling in. Let's see, we'll just... And see, like, nobody's gonna even notice that. They'll just think it's a no just, a, just a part of the hill because that's exactly how it looks. And, like, we'll even do some more blending in. Like, we'll add some dirt. And so, and that it'll, it'll just blend in even more when the grass grows. And see, not even... Not even noticeable. And this is... I'll just show you what we've got so far. So, 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 you know. It's very... Yes, you cannot... You can barely tell. It's just sort of... Well, I mean... You can't... You can't barely tell, but, you know, the average person would just walk past it. And, you know, I even have no light in the first part of the tunnel, just because so it doesn't attract more attention. Although, you can hear the chickens, and you can see them pop their little heads through. But, you know, I, I, otherwise I made sure that it was well lit up, and the stairs, they work. So you can just, you can go down, and, you know... 
you know, pretty standard stuff, really. And then you'll end up in this cavern. And back and you can go and to and then they should hopefully be able to just leave the way they came. Oh, Wendy. Sir Goggles, where are you pushing, Wendy? <laughs> no. Are you sure about that? Cause her wing's half off the side. Alright. Play nice. And we will make sure that the pixies actually get home. Did you enjoy your cake? I hope so. Are there only three of you? Oh no, okay, good. Good, good, good. Uh, we'll just, we'll, well, I guess, oh, right. I already told your fellow pixie, but, or I guess I didn't tell her about, so, okay, so. I just made you guys an entrance, so if you need to come in, please use the entrance. Since you were able to see seek out the hot spring just by sense, you you'll be able to find the entrance. Okay? It is on it's on that on the on the side closest to the water. But if you need to if you need to use it again, you're welcome to come in. Just don't use the customer entrance. Cause like I said, you could get hurt, somebody could step on you, or they could even do it on purpose. So, be careful, you know? Alright, we'll get you guys home. We'll get girls- Ah! We'll get you girls home. And the reason I don't trust the pixies to fly home is because they do- They do tend to wander, so I feel like I need to make sure that they actually get to their- To their little village safely, you know? You know, make sure. And the last pixie. Oh! You were hungry, weren't you? How was it? Oh, I hope it was good. I hope so. There we go. But yes. And to be honest, I've had an epiphany. All of these dragon things that I came over with or I found, I just... It doesn't feel right keeping them since I have Wendy. I, it's just... I, I, I need to... Cause like, this is gonna be the size of Wendy one day, and it's just, I just, I don't, I, uh, I can't stand the feeling of, so there, I can't stand the feeling of having something that is in, supposed to be inside Wendy, on the outside of her. So I cannot, I cannot keep them. I cannot. It does not. It makes my skin itch and crawl just to just to even be in contact with those now i uh, i mean i used to sort of work with them a little bit back in back at back at home but now i just now i can barely stand the sight of them do i have any anything other any any more dragon things okay good we've gotten rid of everything um, whatever. But yes, that is going to be the end. That is going to be the end of this episode of Minecraft Fantasy. I hope you enjoyed. And I hope, like, that was some absolute pandemonium at the start of the episode with all of, all of the pixies and the hippogriff and they were trying to attack each other. Ah, jeez. <laughs> that was a lot to deal with. And so we had to make ourselves a little eco-highway so to speak um but yes that is going to be the end of the episode have a good day have a good week and i'll see you in the next one a good bye <laughs> uh, hello chickens i wonder any rotten eggs any any egg boys doesn't look like it all right